There's much time left to see the piano teacher at the Playhouse in the Park, and the star of the show, Dale Hodges, is here. Okay, welcome, and it's so nice to meet you. You play yeah. Mrs. K. I do. This is being called a tour de force role. How does that strike you? How do you like those words about a role that you're playing? Oh, I think I... Uh, hmm. It's a, it is a challenge, and so I, I would say somebody else can call it a tour de force, I suppose, but uh, for me it's just a really big acting challenge that I'm very grateful to have. Now, I'd love for you to tell people what this play is all about so that they can have an understanding. Uh, I'm not sure I can tell you what it's all about, because that would give some of the secrets away. Sure. But it's, it, it, it focuses on a retired elderly piano teacher. The piano teacher you all had in your suburban communities lives sure. down the block. She says she lives down the block, only charges $15 a half hour, and, and doesn't mind teaching you a few Billy Joel tunes for fun. <laughs> That's basically what she is. Um, so she, all the little children come to her. So she, but she's lonely. She's been retired for many years. She starts calling up old students just on a whim one day and discovers things about her own past life that she didn't know were there. And so the play starts in a rather sweet, cozy way, and as it goes on, it shifts a little. In fact, I think... I think when it was done in New York, somebody referred to it as a, an effective little chiller. Effective <laughs> little chiller. Yeah, now, something uh, like that. I tell you what would chill me is that, as an actress, you are on that stage the entirety of time. Yep. That takes an amazing amount of focus, doesn't it? 90 minutes. Um, and I did wonder if I could learn all the lines, because I do have the bulk of the lines, and I'm very grateful when my two fellow young actors come in and break that up a little bit, and they're wonderful. But... Um, yeah, it, it's a lot. But now I kind of think I have learnt it and that when you're of a certain age in the theatre, you feel very pleased if you've managed to memorise all those lines yet again. You think, OK, I can still do it. And I, it is 90 minutes of concentration. But the audience, the audience, if the audience is with me, it's very rewarding. And I understand the audience is very with you throughout this life. Um, you are a darling, I think it's safe to say, of the Playhouse in the Park. You've been in so many performances there. Why do you enjoy and keep coming back to the Playhouse? Well, they, if they hire me, I'd be well, a fool not I, to. I understand you know, that. I mean, we, we are work. actors are independent contractors. We are always looking for work. But I must say, having been at the Playhouse many times, it's wonderful because it's so familiar, and I do feel like part of the family. And they treat you incredibly well, and and the quality is good. And all the scripts. I've done there have been really terrific. I'm, I've done Christmas Carol 19 times, mm -hmm. and that's a different yes. kind of animal. It's like coming back home every year, you know. So I'm lucky. I'm lucky. Well, you'll be lucky if you get to see the piano teacher. It's only here through March 13th at the Thompson Shelter House Theater. Of course, that's at the Playhouse in the Park up in Mount Adams. Dale Hodges, it's been an absolute pleasure to meet you. Thank, Thank you, you so for coming much, by. Tom.